there's always one that does not want to cooperate. Pretty high tech for around here. <laughs> it's gonna be loud today, y'all. It's gonna be loud. Are we having fun yet? <laughs> so far, so good. What are you? You obviously spoke too soon about this going so easy. Okay, y'all. The water is full. Filled. Whatever. Um, Bonnie's ready to go. We're going. It is, it is finally a good day to work some cows and separate some calves. And it really is a good day because it's overcast. It rained last night. It's overcast. It's much cooler this morning than it has been. And um, so, here we go. Everybody's bright eyed and bushy tail. gates ready. Got a few stragglers to get in. One's way down there. He wasn't sure if he had them all last night. Obviously he didn't, but hopefully they come on. There's always one that does not want to cooperate. There it is. Come on, buddy. That's right. Go find your mama. Yeah, close it. You get it. Grass is hard. Halt. Got him. Woo. Okay. That's the scale that we move out when we're loading them and put back in when we're bringing them through the chute. This thing can be a pain to get just right. This is a um, weighing system by Gallagher that we've had quite a while, but it's worked well. Pretty high tech for around here. <laughs> no, not 80, it's not 80, it's 20. Ah! Four, two, zero. Pretty sure it's the 24th. Yeah. Okay, hit okay, however you do that. Okay. <laughs> All right. And Austin's getting in to, to be our little tester. We'll test, see how much she weighs. Let 86. Her, 86 pounds. Whoa, spider girl. That don't sound right. It don't sound right. It is right. You're a sack of bricks. <laughs> okay. Open this gate so they can come in. Mm, they're going to want to eat that though, aren't y'all? 
I know you are. <laughs> Lawrence the Tin Man. <laughs> oh, he's got to oil the chute. We don't need a chute that won't open. Or close. Close. <laughs> close is really important. <laughs> It works. Sorting sticks. No, let me see. I'm in on later. Mm -hmm. All right. He always goes first. So he'll go in the pen and he'll get as many out by himself as he can. And then one of us, usually me, maybe you, will go in and try to get the rest out. Mm -hmm. And I think probably what he's doing is getting the cows out first. Yeah. We get the cows out. We're gonna run them through the chute. They're gonna get dewormed. And then we're gonna let them out. And then we're gonna go through and separate the calves. So we're weaning today, we're weaning. We're gonna separate the calves, the bulls, the heifers. And then we'll take care of the bulls later. And we'll talk about that later. Okay. It's gonna be loud today, y'all. It's gonna be loud. Bye bye babies. Say bye bye babies. It's time for getting them off of you anyway. You can just concentrate on eating and growing the other baby that you have growing in you. I've been called to duty. Got him. I can't record while I'm doing that. I just have to concentrate. I can remember everything. <laughs> he forgot to buy ear tags, but that's okay because we're gonna run them through again. We gotta run the um, the bulls through again in a, a couple days and ban them. We're gonna ban them this time, and I'll talk more about that later. And then um, we'll tag the heifers, so we'll run them through separately. So anyway. It's all good. All right, let's get some of y'all in here. One, two, three, four. Come on. Can't go two at a time. Too big for that. <laughs> all righty. There we go. Okay. Gotta get another group in. Who's ready to go? Hey, hair. Look at you. She's got a fancy do. <sighs> 14 white. What are you doing? You got to go that way here in a second, okay? Okay. Thanks for listening. Good girl. Good girl. 14 white. <laughs> yeah. Hey, number nine. Number nine. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? Are we having fun yet? <laughs> I know I said it was cooler this morning, and it is, it's overcast, but it's still a little sticky, isn't it? I might have to jump in the half field pool with you today. It might be a little cold. Might be a little cold. We'll see, we'll see. That one weighs 11.50. Put it in the number. Six Y, six yellow. Just putting on our dewormer. And away she goes. Since we're not giving them shots or putting in ear tags, we don't have to actually catch them in the head sheet. That's why we're not doing that. We just get some in there, put some dewormer on, and let some go. Oh, 
Look out, girls. All right. Uh, Mike can get them all in one more group. Probably two. Sometimes this takes two hands. Or not. I've learned not to do that with my fingers so it doesn't get caught because ouch. Okay, girls. Ew. Wipe my arm in the big fat thing of poo. Okay. Let's go. Who's going in? That's right. Woohoo! My gate. My gate's wanting to close on me. I can fix that. Okay. Four, five, six. Yeah, I can't get you all in there. Okay. A couple more. Very good. Very good. Hey, cows. Good girls. This cow has lost her ear tag, so she gets a new one. Twenty-three yellow it is. <laughs> okay, last group of cows to get in. Come on, girls. It's just y'all. Good girls. Good girls. Thank you. Ah, these went in a little easier. <laughs> These babies are very quiet, actually. It's time. It's been past time. You're going to do just fine. Mamas, you're going to do fine, too. Without them babies sucking on you. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Bye bye. Say bye. All right, now the cows are coming out. We'll run them through the chute and we'll separate them as they come through the sheep. <laughs> and now a quick message from Farmer's Edge. Man, there's a lot of great technology these days. Everything from imagery to weather information to live market updates and even machine telematics. They're all great, except they all kind of live in their own little world. And if you want to try to combine that data together, you really can't, at least not easily. And if you want to share it with a trusted advisor, well, Good luck with that. I mean, the whole thing is kind of a mess. But at Farmer's Edge, we bring all this information together into one place so you can view it easily and make sense of what's going on out in the field. Book your demo today at farmersedge.ca. He's talking to him. He said, what do you say, babe? <laughs> They're all bunched up in the back corner. Can be like trying to herd cats. Okay, we need to get out of uh, eyesight so we don't spook them. So they'll come out. Slowly but surely they're coming out. <laughs> they're very, very quiet, aren't they all? They're not screaming right now. They're not screaming, you're right. I think that means they were ready. <laughs> Yeah, I see you. I see you. That was smooth going. They acted the whole gym around me. I don't know how they're going to act. <laughs> yeah, they, they acted good. great. They're not talking much either. You reckon that means it was time? <laughs> Whoa, I got hit with a sorting stick. He said he's actually got enough tags for the heifers, so that's good. We'll tag them, then we don't have to bring them back in. Well, y'all, this is honestly not, honestly not my fave. Uh, moving the, trying to get the calves up.
the calves kick, they can kick. And sometimes they go well, and sometimes you have to push them one by one. So, we'll see. So far, so good. They're actually doing very well. And I probably just jinxed myself. Yeah, we've worked about eight, run about eight, three. So, I have to tell them if it's a heifer or a bull, and I have to get them in there which I've just been doing by twisting tails. I haven't had to actually get in the sheep in the alley, so. I may though, before this is said and done. Come on, buddy. So this is a little bull. <laughs> they really, these, these, they, I was getting ready to say that. These calves are more gentler than their mothers were. They're, they're really doing well. So that, that bull weighed 668 what we have here what are you what are you you are a bully you are a man for a few more days yeah so see I'll grab their tail just to help help uh, move them move them ahead come on buddy you can do this a bull it's a bull it's a bull it's a bull What's he weigh? 5.90. Five 5.90. Nine. Five He's smaller. Good babies. Good babies. Is there one more here? No. That's it. So, the one thing nice about working these calves a little larger is that they're not as tempted to turn around in the sheet, in the alley. So, um... Yeah, that's nice. I'm not having to go back and open the gate and turn them around or get in there and try to manhandle them and turn them around. So, that's good. I'm having a little rest while he uh, changes the dewormer. And y'all, it's starting to rain. <laughs> lightly. It's lightly raining. It's spitting. It's spitting. Hopefully it won't do a whole lot more than spit. Even though I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, it feels really good in a little rain. It's not gonna hurt the situation. Of all the days in the last three weeks that we could have done this, this is the best one that we've had. So, huh, how about that? Sometimes things work out for the best. Hey, you sweet babies. I'm so proud of you. You're just a good bunch of calves. Yeah, I just want to snuggle you. They're being so good, y'all. They really are. Mm. Yes. Makes me happy. Um, about 12 left. Um, well, the last couple times I've been putting seven or so. They've been doing good. I know it's raining. I don't think y'all are going to melt, right? <laughs> Come on, girl. That's not the way. Come on. She's trying to turn around. That was just a quick little shower. It's over. Feels maybe a little bit more humid, which I guess would make sense. Well... Everybody worked well, didn't they? Y'all did good too. Thank you for your help. Your good little cattle hands. You too. <laughs> oh, thank God he's counting. Yeah. I gotta compliment them. They done better than the kids. I, uh, I agree. He said he had to compliment them. They'd done better than any calves he'd ever worked. I'm just saying, I hope the rest of this year's crop is, works this easy. No, not even one tried to turn around. Well, not really. Yeah, the last one didn't want to go, but didn't have to do much to get them in there. You expect the heifer to be a little boogie. Good day. Good day. And best weather we've had in, what, a month?
for doing this. Right? Yep. Yep. <laughs> All right. Let's get the cow back. Pick up that trough down yonder. I already got one trough out there to feed them in. I bought four new troughs. I'm trying to figure out where they're at. So, we obviously did some counting wrong. We got here to let the cows out and found two more calves. Yeah. So. so he's luring the cows away from the fence, from the gate, and we're gonna see if these two come in. Okay, well there goes one. We need the other one. Come on, son. It's not nap time. It's time to come in here. Obviously spoke too soon about this going so easy. <laughs> Had to drive them all back in here just to get those two calves out. Here comes the sun. <laughs> Okay, take two. You're going back out again. Now that we got the others in. <laughs> All right, girls. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, the good thing is that they actually all did have a calf. There was one that was really late, and that's the one he was thinking didn't have one, but there's one late one. Small baby. Small bull. It's really good looking though. Anyway, so all saw it ends well. <laughs> At least those last two were bulls, so we were able to put them in with the other without having to do a lot of maneuvering. I'm not ready for something to eat. Okay, now there's like eight more things to do. Gotta put, put a bale of hay out, move some troughs around. I don't know. There's about four different things. Okay, gotta gotta take the mule over there with the feed. The mule? Yeah, the mule. I keep wanting to say gator, even though we don't have that anymore. Uh, this gate. This gate has wasp in it. Try not to get stung. They're down there. They're all around. It's starting to sprinkle again. Actually, it sounds like thunder. Just a few um, barn ward, barn ward. <laughs> I'm getting really hungry. Uh, just a few barnyard weeds in here. All right, they're getting hay, two buckets of barley. This is a heifers, heifers, heifers. Happy heifers. <laughs> so the secret to opening a gate with wasp in it, do it very carefully. You're welcome. This is for the bulls, the baby bulls. He said we would have worked him today, which would be really nice because the weather's good. But he needs to go Ted Hay. So, that's that. Just wait for it to get hot again before we 
change some minds for some bull calves. Whoops, I just came inside and had to reach over my bed to get something. Evidently, I'm, I'm bringing half of the corral inside. Oh my. Dish time. And he's off. Off to Ted. He's telling the kids bye. The kids are in the pool. They're in the pool again. They're having fun. They worked hard this morning. Everybody worked hard. Everybody's tired. They get to play. And we get to keep working. I have lots of work I need to do on my computer. And he's going back to the field. So, there we go. And Bonnie... Bonnie is also working hard per usual. Right, girl? And our basically daily UPS delivery is here. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll, get it. I'll keep playing. Look, I've been meaning to get... I've been meaning to get him on video. Let's see if he'll let me video him. Come on. <laughs> you want to be on YouTube? Yeah, you do, don't you, Clint? Uh, this is my, one of my favorite of the drivers, <laughs> Clint. Hi, YouTube. Yeah, hi, YouTube. Yeah, I told you I was going to get you on here one day. She did say that. <laughs> I told him, I was like, oh, my daily, my daily delivery is here. It's pretty random. I mean, it's pretty regular, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I don't even know what this is. <laughs> I do get a lot. I do. It saves me. I'm a regular. I am a regular. You're right. You make my life easier. I appreciate you. Hey. <laughs> Do you see the pool? I saw, I saw the pool. Yeah. You guys didn't waste no time either. No. We got it up in the night. It's halfway full. They were playing in it yesterday with like six inches of water in it. <laughs> water is water. Water is water when it's this hot, right? Exactly. Thank you. You're I'll Bye, see you, you again soon. All right. Oh, I know so. <laughs> Be safe. Bye. Y'all aren't fighting. Oh, yeah. Do y'all think they're so sweet? Does that look sweet to you? Hi. Hey. Are you having fun yet? The sun came out like you wanted. The water's cold, isn't it? It's still filling up, y'all. Look, it's still filling up. But we're halfway there. Oh my goodness. Well, they're having a blast, so that's good. Uni! Yes. <laughs> uni. Don't hurt uni. Oh my gosh. Heading back down my favorite red dirt road. Haha. <laughs> Farm over service in full effect right now. I think I'm going to get me like one of those little, uh, like a sign. Or like a little little light thing to put on top of the truck for delivery. Farm delivery. Farm Uber. Not delivery. Whatever. Yeah. It needs to be a thing. It needs to be a thing. There's there's there, somebody needs to make that. Let's make a sticker. Farm Uber. Bumper sticker. Would you buy that? I would use that. Maybe I'll make one. And it's all t -t -t tetted. It's all tetted. It's a lot of hay out there, I believe. It's a tired farmer right there. It's all tetted. It's going to get tetted again. Thus, little blue is getting to stay down here for the night. Any problems? No. Hot. Hot. I forgot about that. You're not in the AC down here with the big flies, too. Do they bother you? No. Good day, gonna be cutting next week. Cutting next week. We're getting Brown ready to just... cold out there, man. Oh my gosh. Wow. Um, we're gonna be busy for a while yet, aren't we? Huh? We're gonna be busy for a while yet. Hmm? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Water on the bed, but over there kind of wet. Foot dollars and then oh. it's starting to flower, so we don't get no water on there. That's it. Well, once 
hope we get some water then. Ain't put the rain on the hay, but. Man, that's a lot of hay.